Hey everybody, my name is Ivica. Thank you so much for being on my latest Let's Play video. After a long time, I'm trying out a new game and it's a really cool racing title that you can get on Steam right now called Hover Cars 3077-3077 Underground. As you can hear, it has an amazing soundtrack. That was my first impression. I tried the game a little bit beforehand and I'm going to show it to you right now. Also the good news is that I have a bunch of free keys that I can give out for this game. All that you need to do is to subscribe to my channel of course and leave a comment below asking for a Steam key and you'll get one courtesy of Hovercars 3077 Underground. So. Without further ado, let's check out some of its basic functions and then see the game in action and how does it play. As you can see, we have our solo mode, we have our versus and we have leaderboard settings and garage. Right now it's in Bitcoin, we need 4000 Bitcoins, that's a lot of Bitcoins. But let's check out how the garage looks. This is also a great preview of the cars. I love the design, it's a hover car, but it's also really vintagey, something that looks like it was made in the 80s, alternative 80s, and that's an amazing approach, at least for me, the yellow taxi cab. And we have other vehicles as well that I'm going to showcase real quick. All of them feature great design, I love the reflections and how the paint job looks. Another vintage, this is something older, it looks like something from the Batman universe, but a retro Batman universe. And this is a good way of showing you how the game looks like in this like great level of detail. As you see, there is a bunch of cars that you can find and get, but we're not going to do any of that. We're going to race for now and see the game in action. So I'm not going to go versus, I'm going to go solo. And we have our championship, arcade and time trial. I'm going to go for arcade. Here is my option to select a vehicle. That's Samurai version V300. And I, I have a selection of a lot of different tracks, but I'm going to go for the desert, which is unlocked. So let's fly. Now, the first thing I saw as the gameplay commences is that the game is really fast but at the same time really challenging. Of course that's a great view to perceive or a way to perceive the game if you're into high octane really dynamic racing titles and most of you will likely be if you're watching this video. Hovercrafts and flying vehicles in particular have that sense of moving real fast, moving with a lot of kinetic energy. This game has it too, which is a great feature of overall game design, but it's something that also makes it quite challenging. So here we are, and the first second I'm breaking down here, the second second I'm breaking down, I'm doing my booster, but now I'm going to try and take it down a notch. As you can see, you have your ability to kind of slow down and I'm going to use it opulently because otherwise it's just going to be a fest of, yeah, crashes <laughs> and it's a fest festival of crashes even without it. And this is a particularly challenging element and you need to go through a really tight space here. I'm breaking all of the time, but again, check out the soundtrack. It's really cool, it's really dynamic. And here are my boosters, I didn't manage to get any of these. And I'm crashing constantly. Again, even though there is a lot of racing title on my channel, racing content better said, I'm not a racing title kind of person, especially when I first start playing a game. I'm doing it like a really, really old person <laughs> which I'm slowly becoming actually and I'm just trying to not to break down here but of course you have your booster mode as you saw it looks amazing again 
the game is challenging it requires some getting used to the commands and the whole kinetic element of the gameplay which is insanely fast at least for me here is a booster that I just managed to miss again I need to slow down also there is the whole point of having kind of a car that is just a beginner model so it's less responsive than some other models I'm betting but still I have my machine gun here as you can see I can shoot on other cars I just managed to nip, nip one of them but still I'm let's go for that booster again the level of challenge is right there and it's huge I personally clearly need a lot <laughs> of kind of uh, space and time to trial it out and to get better to kind of figure out the commands and let that booster fly again a great effect and yeah you can see it immediately the quality of assets is huge and it really shows in the final product which is polished oh, this is going to be a crash for sure which is polished and really nice looking <laughs> I'm disastrously bad at it but to be fair this is my second race so far so it's not that surprising and still I'm having loads of fun even though I'm losing constantly and I'm sure that anyone who is into racing titles would enjoy this immensely at last <laughs> last moment of crash and yeah I'm pretty terrible but I managed to get 4000 bitcoins so that's not bad at all but you saw it this is the game in its purest form in its essence the arcade mode there are other modes as well it's really fun to play it's really interesting it's really well made the quality of audiovisuals the quality of the approach as a whole which isn't hugely surprising but it is well placed in this kind of a genre makes this game more than interesting to anyone who is into racing titles so hover cars 377 3077 underground is a game that a lot of you racing fans would likely enjoy so please check out the link in the description below it will take you to the steam page for the same title if you like to have a copy of this game there are five keys that i'm giving out please subscribe to the channel and leave a comment below i'll get in touch with the first five persons who do that and give you a steam key that's all for me thank you so much for watching this video i really appreciate it my name is ivica hopefully you enjoyed it if you did please subscribe to my channel there is going to be a bunch of content related to the gaming incoming and there is already a bunch of content related to the gaming that you can enjoy hopefully enjoy right now my name is Ivica thank you so much for watching thank you so much for being here and I'll see you on my next let's play video until then bye bye